Good morning, guys, or good afternoon, and good night to people halfway around the world where I live.、Um, <laughs> so it is officially eleven thirty-two where I live, and I just woke up, and I'm having Nutella as as breakfast. See, there's my milk, and that's my Nutella. Anyways, Nutella is so good. It's basically like chocolate goodness. You can put it on anything; it'll taste good. Anyways, um, so I just have to urge to show you something. So that is my puppy wall, and all the pictures are from a puppy calendar, and that is a copy picture of I think it's from Van Gogh. I think I'm not sure, and then some butterflies which I need to rearrange because it's messed up. A Hollister red bag, super hot. Um, me dog. <laughs> and if you guys want to see my film kiss, um, because a lot of you asked me like if if I had a film case or not, so I just I just want to show you. That's me right there. It is not hard. I mean, it it's not soft. It's hard. And this can open. It's a cookie house. It's so adorable. <clears throat> Back to the mini dog. And oh, just because when you guys asked me to sort of look at that window, that's my neighbor right there. So the neighbor across from me、um, has a pool, as you can see. But we have a hot tub, so I think hot tubs beat pools any day. No, but seriously, I would kill to have a pool. And it is the day where we have to take out the trash. Boop 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 boop. boop. So yeah, that's our neighborhood. We don't live in a rich community, so don't think that we do. Okay, so the reason why I'm making this video is just to say thank you guys so much yesterday for the support when I was completely down and completely out of my mind. Sorry, I just had to burp. <laughs> um. Yeah, and so you guys wanted to know the story, so I'm going to tell you the story. A minute later, after I posted the first winner's video, I had a comment saying、um, that I clicked the generate button twice, and I was like, "Oh, I'm sorry, I can't do anything about that. I didn't realize back then, and it's already posted. I don't think I can do much about that."、Um, Person that replied, and then all of a sudden, I got like twenty other mess comments saying that oh you clicked it twice, oh you clicked it twice, you clicked it twice, you clicked it twice. You didn't realize you clicked it twice. I did, for goodness sake, realize I clicked it twice. Just after I published it, I realized it, and um, like I didn't want to remake it because it would sort of seem unfair. Because what's done is done, and there's nothing you can do about it. But you guys are driving me insane. After like the twenty comments that I got, I got almost thirty messages saying that you clicked it twice. You realize that, right? I was like, yes, gosh darn it! I realized that I clicked it twice. The one and some looked so much alike on camera. So you know what? Like, there's nothing I can do about it. But no, you guys could not stop the the messages and the comments kept on flowing in. And it's not just about the clicking twice mistake. Okay, it's also about the fact that the fact that. You guys did not win. Okay, so excuse you for not winning, but you have to realize that random dot org is random, right? Like you, you know that it's random, right? So it does not matter how many times you comment. You can comment a hundred times, and there can only be a hundred and one comments. And the hundred and one first person who commented wins. Out of the other hundred times wins. It's not my fault. It's random. dot org, and you cannot get any more random than that. You do realize that the website URL is random. dot org, right? So it is random. There's nothing I can do about it. It's not like I control it, and it's not like I'm I'm hacking it or anything like that. It, it's random, okay? Um. So, please accept the fact that you do not win, and. You guys are saying that what's the big deal of that? Like just because you're getting a few messages? No, I got almost like a hundred messages after five minutes saying that it's not fair. It's not fair. I answered so many times. It's not fair. Oh my goodness, you guys! And 
like so many people like, like two to three people say that um I can't handle stress or I can't handle hate. Um, I'm pretty sure you never felt the hateness I got yesterday. You probably never felt it. Okay, um, imagine getting over a hundred comments in a period of five minutes. Hundred messages, I mean, in a period of five minutes saying that it's not fair, I should have won. You probably never had that before, had that feeling, that had that hateful feeling before inside of you. So I don't know who you are you to judge me, but I think I can handle stress perfectly well. I'm not crying at your guy's face saying, oh my gosh, I can't do this anymore. I'm quitting YouTube forever. No, I'm saying that I'm not having any more giveaways and it's not proving to me that I cannot handle stress. It's just simply saying that I can't deal with everyone's troubles. I can't deal with everyone's problems and solving it and giving you like a high five star and on your forehead and giving you a gold sticker say oh it's okay honey that you didn't win no i can't do that okay i'm accepting the fact that people are gonna hate because they did not win and it's not like i have any control over that so who are you to judge me saying that you can't handle any stress deal with it it's reality do, i am doing here right do you see me do you see me running over people's head begging for the help to stop hating on me? I don't think so. So whatever you guys are trying to do, it's either to bring me down from YouTube, it's either to keep me shut from the real world and saying that um, you're hopeless. You, If you can't handle hate or stress like that, you're hopeless. Okay, I bet you never had over 100 PMs in a period of five minutes hating messages over a hundred hate messages coming that just like a second later another message another message you probably will not handle it as good as i will handle it sure i get hate hate messages every single day but i would care less about the messages they send me because they are just useless messages that people send me to make themselves feel better after they sent it but they think that it's going to make me feel worse and it's going to make me quit Honey, you have to wake up and realize that that's not going to give a shit about what's going to happen in the future. I'm always going to stay strong. I'm always going to stay top of what's going to happen. I don't care what's going to happen in the future. I'm going to stay strong. And anything that happens to me, any hate or any preposterous action that's going to get into my YouTube life, into my trading life, into my self-confidence, it's not going to affect me any more than it will affect you. Okay? So... You know what? Realize that the truth, truth, <sighs> sorry for freaking out, you guys. Sorry. Um, so I think that's all I have to say. Um, sorry for freaking out, but I just had to get that thing out of my mind. By the way, haters, unsubscribe right now. If I see you still subscribe to me, I would literally just hunt you down saying that you have to unsubscribe to me right now. I don't want people like you. I don't care how many subscribers I lose. Just unsubscribe. I don't... People like you don't even deserve to have an account on YouTube. Sitting here hating on people. Like, what better can you do with your life? Like, oh my goodness. Um, so for my supporters, I want to give you a huge thank you supporting me. And it's going to be nine minutes very soon, so I have to go right now. <laughs> Eating my Nutella. So, bye guys.